Hi everyone and welcome to the channel. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon. Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to stake a standard model, add two channels for your flaps and also incorporate the um, snail feature in where the uh, flaps would actuate very slowly. So we're going to have a look at uh, Edge TX Companion and then we're going to switch over to the radio. So let's go have a look. So I've got my, my model open. I'm going to go to the inputs. Now you can see this is set up from my previous last video where I've got expo and I've got dual rates, but we need to go to mixers. And you can see I've added two channels, channel five and six. Now they replicate each other. Now the minus and plus weights, if you have watched my other videos, you know if depending on the way you install the servos within your wings, you will have to choose whether these have to be minus weights or, or positive weights so that your flaps actuate correctly. Let's go back to the computer. So the first line, you can see I've named it flaps and we're going to use the source max here. Everything else will be zero figures and with the switch SE, I'm using switch SE and that's in the forward position. So, okay, and then we will add a line. Let's open up that line. It's called flaps max. Now the weight is minus 60 and we've got the switch SE in the middle position. Now we've got the delay here. You can see we've got delay or slow. So I'm slowing those, the um, servos down. So I put two seconds and two seconds for up and down. Then we go to our second line, which you can see it's, uh, the source is max. We've put 80% now to get full flap. We've got offset zero, our curve is zero and our switch SE in the back position. And you can see here, I've set up two seconds for the how slow this servo operates. Now that is everything. I should be able to demonstrate this for you. So you can hopefully see this working. Let's click here. And the channel monitors. So we use Twitch, switch SE. There we go, you can see if you look at channel five and six, they are slowly going up and down. Now let's switch over to the radio and I will show you the settings there. So now let's take a look at the settings on the radio for adding two channels with flaps and using the snail mode. We are going to go to model settings and we're gonna to go to our mixes and we're gonna scroll down and you can see we've got channel five and channel six. now. This one is a mirror of channel five, except for your mixes could be um, a minus figure or a plus figure, as you can see there. But we're just gonna have a look at the first channel, number five. Let's tap that and edit it. And you can see our source is max, weight offset and curve zero, but switch SE in the forward position. And we can return. We'll go to our second flap, which is 60%. And you can see here our source is max, our weight is minus 60% and we have got zero offset and zero curve. We have got the um, switch SE in the middle position and we've added two seconds of slow and uh, slow down and slow up. Let's return out. We're going to go to our final line and you can see here we've got uh, source is max, our weight is minus 80, our offset and our curve are zero percent. I'll switch in the SE in the back position and you can see there are t we've set up the slow up and down with two seconds. So let's get back out. Now let's demonstrate this working. We're going to bring up the channel monitors and you can see our flap switch here. There's the flaps coming down half and coming down slowly and full. Thanks for watching this video and if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and if you didn't give it a thumbs down. If you have any comments or questions please leave them in the comment section below because I'd love to hear from you. And if you have any requests about uh, HTX please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.